so disruptive. Josh and Britt, I cannot wait to get to know you. You just inspired me. I'm going to talk about mission. I was going to talk about something else. We're going to talk about mission. How do you find your mission? I'm going to show you all how you can break up with motivation. Because when you know your mission, you don't need motivation. I have to show you something my daughters made me for a Christmas gift. If you can't read it, it says, I'm not bossy. I'm motivational. <laughs> so here's the thing. I don't need to wake up every morning and say, okay, I need to get motivation to build this. When you know what your mission is, it will pull you. You will not need to push. Who would like to give up the pushing and, you know, pushing a boulder up a hill? Like no one wants to live like that, but you've got to figure out what your mission is and that will pull you. So how do you figure out what your mission is? There's a couple ways to easily find your mission if you don't know what it is. Your mission is different than a goal. So my goal is to be crowned diamond. My mission is to set the captives free. But here's what you're, here's how you find out your mission. Usually, it's usually a combination of these three things. What are you really, really gifted at? It's something that you've been told your whole entire life. Tracy's probably been told something about her her whole entire life, ever since she was a little, little girl. Like she, she, she's been told something that's your gift. I I've always been able to see things. So it kind of makes sense. I'm a disruptor, right? But I've been a truth teller. I can see humans. I'm a psychologist. My gift is I can see you. I can see you. So that is part of your mission. Another way to find your mission is either what breaks your heart or what really makes you mad. What breaks my heart is when people don't understand their worthiness. They don't understand that bliss is their birthright. They don't understand that abundance is available for everyone. Well, that came because I struggled so many years of questioning my worth. So when I say I'm here to set the captives free, I know what that means. Free from unworthiness, free from limitation, free from stress, free from fear, free to be all that they were created to be, free to be healthy. I know that healthy living freed me from clinical depression that also had me suicidal nine years ago. Josh, you and I were probably in the same boat about at the same time. I am the happiest person I know. And I'm not saying that to impress you. I'm saying that to impress upon you that when you are freed from that, you cannot help but share it with people. If I would have known how great I would feel, I would like to think I would have done it way sooner. We have a gift that can set people free and the world of psychology and the world of medicine doesn't want anyone to know because it doesn't make them money. You've never seen a medical conference sponsored by carrots, have you? No, you haven't. It's because it doesn't make them money. We have the secret to set people free. So what breaks your heart or what makes you angry? And then third, you could also probably find your mission with what just makes you so happy and so excited. But what if you got on Facebook Messenger today and said, you know what? I've been given an assignment. I've been told to, to share my mission with 10 people today and you're it. My mission is to set the captives free. I know that sounds a little grandiose, okay? But what I mean by that is, I don't know. I found a way to set our finances free. I have found a way to set my health free. Like, can I bless you with that? What if you did that? What if you shared your mission? Nodder, you're going to have a heart attack over there. You are so funny. I love watching. If you go to all see Nodder on this call, he is so amazing. Share your mission and then keep your mission on the dashboard of your brain. My hunch is if you were in Josh and Britt's world, you would know their mission. You could wake them up at 2 a.m. and be like, what are Josh and Britt's mission? People around them would know. People know my mission, but you got to find your mission and share your mission. And your mission pulls you. I don't have to ask myself if I'm motivated. 
it's an easier, softer way to do things, isn't it? Isn't it a more fun way to do things? I'm just pulled by it. And it makes me appear insanely productive. I'm just clear focused. I just have clarity. And that makes me very productive. Okay. But I'm so crystal clear on my mission. So I hope that blessed you. Thank you. Thank you, Josh and Britt for that. Amazing.